curious, like, what, what's your favorite uh, format of sailing? Uh, there's so many different textures to the sport, and uh, I'd be very curious to know what you find most interesting. Uh, just running here in La Rochelle, you know, that's a big arbor in France, and with a lot of uh, yards and a lot of uh, new boats. And in fact, maybe my favorite way of sailing is the one I'm, I'm not doing enough. I mean, the cruising one with my family. I would like to, and, and just passing through all this area, you have a lot of cruising boats everywhere. And uh, I just passed, uh, I just say hello to some good friends here uh, at the Voilerie, at the Sailmaker Incidents, you know, I used to work with, uh, with them since many, many years, like with you. And, uh, and they are doing a lot of sales for cruising boats here. They are the, the leaders in France, at least. And, um, and so that's one part of the, the way of sailing I would like to do a lot more. I start by doing cruising with my parents on small uh, cruising boats. And I would like to do the same with my children, but they are quite old now. <laughs> I missed the opportunity. But after that, we're back on, on the, the sport area. I had the chance, as you said, to do, since uh, quite a lot of uh, years now, to, to spend my life on any kind of boats, any kind of race, alone, crew, around the cans, or around the world, and on multis, or mono, and, and that's why I don't want to do any choice, because I still have the chance to jump from one, one side to the other of this very large, large uh, or wide spectrum. Mm. And as I said, um, I, I try to be, to say that my specialty is to be a generalist, if I can. As one of five children sailing with your parents, explain a little bit more about some of the um, ex experiences you've been able to share with your children. I'd like to know and understand um, you know, from the perspective of as a father and as a clearly as an experienced yachtsman, how how you tie those things per, perhaps together? Uh, in fact, my as a father like you, like all the fathers, I mean, uh, we still have to learn a lot, learn a lot of things about trying to share and to come on here, to share with our children, and maybe one one good way to do it is to not be at home 24 hours a day, and, and hopefully our job, whatever they are, are, are pretty um, consistent, time consuming or time. And, but, but in fact, my father was a big cap was captain of the super tankers. So that means he was not at home. Uh, he was really, really far from home during two months, three months, or something like that, and then, when he, when he was home, he was really at home. That's not, that was not like a, I should say, a classic job. When you are, you could be at home every day, or I mean every night, but you, are, you wake up very early in the, work, in the morning and you come back home very late in the evening, and so it's worse than not be here. And I, I really like the, 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 the way Comment on dit les métiers d'absence. Comment tu peux dire ça? The absent. How do you say that? When you are not, when you are not somewhere, that means you are missing yeah. the, the the missing jobs. You know the jobs who makes you, which makes you away from home, away from the highs, but uh, close to the heart maybe sometimes. Mm. And because each time you come back, the value is better and bigger than if you stay all the time, but without any kind of presence, and that's very interesting for that. And I, I think that I had the chance to have a, a job like that. And for instance, my first daughter, Mary, was born uh, 22 years ago during the first Vendée Globe, you know, the first one in the, the world trip alone. And it's true, I was not home when when she was born. I was just near the Kerguelen Islands in the, in the Indian Ocean. That's why her name is Marie Kerguelen. And, and there is a little poetry in that. <laughs> <laughs> That's better than not be here, but just being uh, in the traffic jam, being uh, uh, blocked in the traffic jam, not far from your home. Uh, I prefer to miss a, a big event by being far away for some good other reason. And then after that, to try to transmit or to transfer this sort of 
it's not easy, you know, my children are, I have four children, uh, three daughters and one son, and it's start to be quite old now, and, and they love to say, but they are not going to be sailors, for sure not. Um, one is uh, doing some chiropractic, and the other one is surfing, and, and that's it, the life is the life, and I'm, I'm not looking, I don't want to feed the new generation to be sure that they are going to follow me or to try to do better than we've, we've done. They are going to live their life and that's it.